Hello, I'm Chef David. Thank you for visiting Scrumptious Foods. Today we are going to discover the uses for our Scrumptious Tomato Marmalade, a great substitute when fresh tomatoes just aren't available. Tomato Marmalade is a sweet, savory condiment with aromatic spices. It's a tasty complement to grilled and roasted meats. Today we're going to be making one of my favorites, a Brie LT. You start with a slice of one of your favorite nice crusty breads, a multi-grain or a sourdough, whatever works for you. You're going to have it grilled or toasted, and then you're going to spread it with a nice thick layer of your scrumptious tomato marmalade. Get it all the way to the edges. Just kind of spread it out so every bite has the flavor and the good combination. Now we need to add the bacon to the sandwich. I like to use a nice applewood smoked bacon. It's got a, a, a very distinct flavor and uh, it's not as heavy smoked as a, as a hickory bacon. And I also bake the bacon and don't fry it as it lays flatter on your sandwich. After you've covered the top of the sandwich with your slices of bacon, you take your slices of brie cheese. You want to use a good quality brie cheese on this. Slice it somewhat thin, lay it over the top of the sandwich. You don't want to use a brie that's too ripe as when you put it into the oven, under the broiler to melt it, it's going to disappear. So cover the top with your brie cheese and then into the broiler we go and we're going to leave it in the broiler just a few minutes. The brie is very delicate and it melts quickly and you don't want to melt it till it's gone. While that's in the oven, if you want to get your fresh baby arugula that's going to go on top, dress it very lightly with a little bit of extra virgin olive oil and just a pinch of kosher salt and toss it lightly. Let's check the oven and make sure our sandwich is probably ready. Cheese is melted over nicely. And here is our heated sandwich, which we are now going to top with our wonderful baby arugula. So much better than lettuce. It's just got a nice peppery spiciness to it that adds a whole nother dimension to the sandwich. And we're going to cut it in half and plate it up and enjoy. Some other popular suggestions to use the tomato marmalade is a wonderful, simple, last minute, quick appetizer you can make up. Just take any sort of your favorite little crostini, cracker, toasted bread topped with a soft, either a soft goat cheese or any sort of a nice spreadable cheese that you have and then top the cheese with a dot of your tomato marmalade and it's a wonderful combination. Another nice use for the scrumptious tomato marmalade is on any of your favorite egg dishes. This is a, a four cheese omelet that we've made topped with the tomato marmalade. It adds a whole new dimension to your simple prepared breakfast.